हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू माय केमिस्ट्री चैनल बी एल द शॉर्ट एंड स्वीट इन केमिस्ट्री नाउ आई एम गोइंग टू फोकस द टॉपिक इम्पोर्टेंट इनऑर्गेनिक कंपाउंड्स फॉर क्लास टेन दो इट इज क्लास टेन डायमेंशन बट इट इज आल्सो वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर क्लास इलेवेंथ एंड क्लास ट्वेल्थ साइंस नाउ ये इन पार्ट फाइव आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन कंपाउंड सेविंग डाई वेलेंट केट आयन एंड डाई वेलेंट एन आयन बिफोर दैट इन पार्ट वन पार्ट टू part 3 part 4 already i have explained monovalent cation and monovalent anion divalent cation and divalent anion all things are completed so here uh, what happened in compounds having divalent cation and divalent anion uh, is observed the cation having plus 2 charge that bas- that means which are divalent cation cation having that having plus 2 charge and that is also called basic radical generally we can say group 2 elements are divalent cations what are the uh, group 2 elements and generally here what are the group 2 metals actually uh, what are the elements in group 2 in the periodic table that is magnesium calcium strontium barium radium here almost all barium up to barium they form compounds easily but for radium it is difficult uh, difficult because it is one type of other element and here cup except group 2 elements or uh, group 2 metals here uh, other metals also shows plus 2 valency plus 2 charge and now here what happened these are cu plus 2 zn plus 2 fe what is cu plus 2 cupric cuprous is plus 1 cupric is plus 2 zn plus 2 zn plus 2 zinc plus 2 fe plus 2 mean ferrous if it is ferrous it is plus 2 if it is ferric plus 3 pb plus 2 lead plus 2 ni plus 2 nickel plus 2 mn plus 2 manganese plus 2 that means these all are having um, plus 2 charge that is why they are divalent uh, cation and uh, so you will come into anions anions also uh, minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 are there so here nn having minus 2 charge and nn is also called as radical here you should remember co3 minus 2 carbonate so4 minus 2 uh, sulfate so3 minus 2 sulfite s minus 2 sulfite this is d this is t remember s minus 2 that is sulfide d d e and o minus 2 oxide and cro minus CrO4 minus 2 chromate and Cr2 7 minus 2 dichromate MnO4 minus 2 manganese again see CO3 minus 2 carbonate SO4 minus 2 sulfide SO3 minus 2 sulfide S minus 2 uh, that is sulfide D IDE O minus 2 oxide CrO4 minus 2 chromate Cr2O7 minus 2 dichromate MnO4 minus MnO4 minus 2 that is manganese. Now here I hope it is clear. The uh, having valency 2 if there are metals, there are uh, there are cations that are called as basic radical. Sorry, basic radical and anions having minus 2 charge that is called uh, basic radical for uh, sorry acid radical having minus 2 charge. So what is the here the um, compounds having divalent cation and divalent anion? That means the basic radical should contain plus two charge. Acid radical should contain minus two charge. See here, magnesium carbonate, magnesium carbonate, magnesium you no know, Mg plus two because here Mg plus two because Mg belongs to second group of the periodic table. So Mg having plus two charge, CO3 having minus two charge, it gives Mg CO3 because you can say this has two, this has two. Basic radical two charge and acid radical two charge both cancel each other, and what is the formula? Mg CO3. Calcium sulfide. Calcium also belongs to second group having plus two charge. Then S minus two sulfide. I told sulfide S minus two cancel each other. CaS. I hope it is clear. The fundamental knowledge you should know. What are the divalent cation? What are the divalent anion? 
try to remember and after that you try how the compounds form by the help of uh, um, divalent cation and divalent anion. Now we will proceed to other compounds having uh, residual plus 2 charge, residual having minus 2 charge. Now you can see the other examples are barium sulfate that means Ba plus 2. Ba belongs to second group of the periodic table that is why plus 2. SO4 sulfate is minus 2. 2 to cancel so formula BaSO4. Strontium sulfate and here you can find strontium is Sr plus 2 and sulfate SO4 minus 2. Strontium belongs to second group that is why plus 2. So after cancelling the formula is Sr SO4. Now see calcium sulfide. Calcium sulfide SCA plus 2 and a sulfide. I told sulfate SO4 minus 2. Sulfide T I T E SO3 minus 2. So it is CA SO3. Then come to magnesium oxide Mg plus 2 O minus 2 both cancel. So MgO the correct answer. Barium carbonate barium Ba plus 2 belongs to second group and CO3 minus 2 BaCO3 cancel each other. Calcium chromate calcium is plus 2 chromate. What is the formula of chromate? CrO4. CrO4 minus 2. After cancelling, the formula is CaCrO4. Then come to magnesium manganate. Manganate. MnO4 minus 2, that is manganate. MnO4 minus 1, that is permanganate. But permanganate is not required here, it is manganate. So, Mg MnO4, Mg plus 2, MnO4 minus 2 cancel each other and it becomes to Mg. MnO4 that is the correct uh, answer magnesium manganate Mg MnO4 barium uh, dichromate what is the form of dichromate Cr2O7 minus 2 so it comes to BaCr2O7 again see barium sulfate I told before also what are the elements generally here uh, act as a divalent cation in the periodic uh, two the elements are having plus two ions. So, so what are the elements here? Uh, that is uh, magnesium, calcium, strontium, barium, radium. And radium is the uh, this metal, nuclear metal, nuclear element. That is why and it is very difficult to form any compound and like this. And so only we will see uh, magnesium, calcium, barium, sorry, strontium, barium. That means these are the elements we will see, these are the metals, we can check how the, uh, how the other compound also form by the help of divalent anion. So, strontium sulfate SRSO4, calcium sulfite uh, CSO3, where sulfide is minus 2 SO4, minus 2 that is sulfate. And mag oxide, oxide is minus 2, so magnesium oxide NGO, if you say calcium oxide CAO, if you say strontium oxide SRO like this. Then barium carbonate BaCO3 because 2 to cancel so the formula is BAC calcium chromate chromate is CrO4 having minus charge and calcium plus 2 charge cancel each other the formula is CaCrO4 magnesium manganate Mn MnO sorry Mg MnO4 Mg means magnesium MnO4 means having charge minus 2 manganate barium dichromate Ba plus 2 Cr2O7 minus 2 so BaCr2O7 so uh, what you learned here that means that uh, divalent enhance are uh, here a sulfate, sulfide, oxide, carbonate, chromate, manganate and dichromate you are using in here and now here uh, I hope uh, it is clear how the compounds form by the help of divalent cation and divalent anion. 
Now, there are other uh, elements, uh, metals are there, which are not belongs to that mean here, which uh, second group, but it belongs to uh, which is uh, which um, transition metal that is belong to transition metal group. That means, uh, tra what is transition metal, all the things you will clear when you will go to higher class. And now, here only you learn that is Cu plus 2, that means cupric, Fe plus 2, ferrous lead pb plus 2 lead like this uh, zinc redden plus 2 zinc plus 2 that means these are the uh, some few uh, metals are there in coming video i will explain these transition metals which are having divalent cation and how they form the compound with the help of divalent anions what i told before and you will see in the coming video i hope uh, you will uh, subscribe my channel via the short and sweet in chemistry and also please like and share uh, my channel and uh, hope uh, uh, I can I may produce more videos regarding about your inorganic compounds. Uh, thanks for watching my video. Thanks again to all.